There is some breaking news out of Minneapolis. A CNN crew has been arrested while its members were covering those protests live on the air, and it's a face you might recognize under that mask. That is Omar Jimenez, who used to be a reporter here in Baltimore. Now he's a correspondent with CNN, and as you see, shortly after 5 o'clock this morning Central Time, so 6 o'clock our time, less than an hour ago, Omar Jimenez was taken into custody by members of the Minneapolis Police Department. The early word from the Minneapolis Police Department was that Omar Jimenez and his crew did not move uh, when they were told to, and that is why you see those police then taking him into custody custody right there. Just in the past few minutes, CNN, the network has put out a statement and I'm going to read it to you. CNN is calling this a quote, clear violation of their First Amendment rights. The authorities in Minnesota, CNN continues, including the governor, must release the three CNN employees immediately. So when they reference the three employees, they're talking about Omar Jimenez and two members of his crew. There he is being taken away in handcuffs by members of the Minneapolis Police Department. These protests still going on this morning all over the death earlier this week of George Floyd, who died after uh, in police custody. And that video emerged of an officer with his knee on George Floyd's neck. Once again, Omar Jimenez, now a reporter with CNN, used to be a reporter here in Baltimore, taken into custody while apparently trying to cover those protests just this morning, arrested less than an hour ago. Good Morning America coming up at the top of the hour is going to have full coverage of all the events in Minnesota. In fact, there's been protests all over the country. Much more coming up on that. There's also this controversy involving the president and his tweet, which was restricted by Twitter overnight. The president has not yet reacted to that move from Twitter. So much